All right, this one's different. We've seen AI tools get smarter, more specialized, more automated. Warmwind just ripped the ceiling off. These guys built what they're calling the first real AI operating system for cloud employees. And I got early access. You open a browser, log in, and suddenly you're watching AI agents do actual work, clicking, typing, navigating dashboards, handling tools, like a trained human, all inside a live cloud workspace. No code, no local setup, no friction. I tested it myself and walked away genuinely impressed. This spotlight is part of a partnership with Warm Wind, but I wouldn't cover it unless I thought it brought real value. The waitlist is already live and spots are limited. So here's a full breakdown of what it is, how it works, and why this could change how a lot of people get things done. Imagine opening a browser tab, Chrome, Safari, whatever you use, logging in and your own cloud-based workspace is right there. No installations, no GPU setup, no mess. Warmwind spins up an AI OS directly in the cloud and that's where your AI agents work. They call them cloud employees, each powered by their own vision language model. Instead of calling APIs or webhooks, the agent sees what you see. It understands the interface, clicks buttons, types, drags, drops just like a human sitting at the computer. If a person can do it, the agent can too. Setting it up is easy. There's a teaching mode. You walk the agent through a task once, like entering invoice data or pulling analytics, and it learns. Then you add a few prompt guidelines, save it, and it just runs, even with your laptop closed. Everything happens in Warm Winds Cloud. You can run one agent or scale up to 10,000. I tested 20 agents running at the same time, and they handled SaaS dashboards and desktop style apps with low latency and no issues. One good example is in their preview video on YouTube, Warmwind underscore OS. It shows a workflow where the agent pulls CSVs from three different CRMs, merges them, and posts the results into Google Sheets, which feed into Tableau. That's just one template. They've built a full library of roles you can deploy instantly. Take their AI social media growth manager. It finds trending hashtags and audio, drafts posts with custom visuals, schedules them at optimal times, and tests multiple caption options automatically. You only step in if something doesn't fit your brand. Their customer support agent handles email, live chat, WhatsApp, even Instagram DMs. It finds orders in Shopify, checks delivery status, issues refunds, and only passes off tasks that need real human judgment. I tried sending a vague message, where's my package? And it responded in under 10 seconds with tracking info and a discount code since the package was stuck in customs. There's a template for competition tracking. The agent follows competitor accounts, tracks how often they post, measures engagement, spots new product drops, and creates a daily PDF report. It also flags spikes in performance. Accounting is handled too. I uploaded scanned PDF invoices, actual paper scans, and the invoice bot matched them to purchase orders in the ERP. It generated journal entries, set payment reminders, and prepared a monthly profit and loss report, all in QuickBooks with no manual steps. They also have a recruiting agent. It reviews resumes against job descriptions, checks LinkedIn activity, and sets up first round interviews. I watched it scan a candidate's GitHub, send a coding task, and schedule a meeting, all in one pass. There's also a DevOps agent. It monitors uptime, web vitals, and alerts your team if anything drops below performance thresholds. It even records the user experience when issues happen and shares it in Slack that one agent replaces a full SRE alert flow. And then there's the Innovation Scout. Every night, it checks product hunt, archive, crunch base, and patent feeds, then prepares a morning summary of new tools, funding activity, and relevant dev conversations, all of it waiting when you log in. From a tech standpoint, you'll hear two key terms, AI operating system and cloud employees. The OS comparison fits this isn't just a model. It includes a scheduler, permission layer, and secure sandbox. Think Kubernetes for workflows minus the config headaches. Agents also share a memory layer, so if your social media agent flags a customer as angry, the support agent sees that automatically. It's hosted in the EU and encrypted end-to-end, -end, so compliance teams won't panic. And there's a real-time dashboard too where you can view each agent's screen. If an interface changes, like a button moves, you just jump in, correct the flow, and the agent picks it up immediately. No retraining, no downtime. 
Onboarding includes WarmWind's internal app store. It has pre-connectors uh, and desktop clients. I tested Slack, Notion, Xero, Google Workspace, and even a Windows accounting app that normally needs virtualization. All of them worked inside the AI OS without slowing down my machine. It felt like a clean remote desktop session, only faster. A question that comes up a lot, what about latency? It's moving a mouse and typing through a UI. Does it lag? No, not really. They've tuned the system so actions complete about as fast as a skilled human would. I tested a workflow that normally takes four minutes. It finished in two and a half. When scaled up across multiple agents, that kind of speed makes a real difference because everything runs in the browser. Your agents keep working even when you close your laptop. The dashboard shows metrics like uptime, CPU, and memory usage. And if things get busy, say during a sale, you can spin up more agents instantly by duplicating them. They're live in seconds. That kind of scaling flexibility is hard to find with traditional automation tools. Security is built in at the core. Every agent runs in its own isolated container with encrypted credentials and strict access controls. You assign permissions just like you would with an employee. If an agent tries to do something outside its role, like a finance bot messaging someone on Instagram, the OS stops it and sends an alert. I tried feeding it a prompt to leak data to a paste bin and it was blocked immediately with the full attempt logged for review. During testing, I ran 100 concurrent tasks across six SaaS tools. Uptime was 99.98%. Training, each workflow took about four minutes, including prompts. They say it scales to 10,000 agents and costs scale linearly so you can start small and expand as needed. Warmwind is clearly built for both lean teams and large companies trying to cut back on repetitive work. The difference is, you don't need Python scripts, no Zapier chains, no chasing vendors for integrations. The agent sees the screen and adjusts to it. That's the real win. You bypass API roadblocks completely and just keep things moving. One of the engineers, Richard, told me everything runs fully in the cloud. Nothing touches your machine. No drivers, no weird background processes. The vision model isn't built on generic OCR either. It's trained specifically for working across multiple interfaces. In the Q&A, he mentioned they're planning future features like voice commands and session replays. But for now, the focus is on stability. They've just launched and the wait list is now open. Early access is rolling out in Wave, so if you wanna get in, Now's the time to register. The waitlist is live at warmwind.space. If you get invited, you'll get access to the workspace and a demo walkthrough on their YouTube. They also post live agent clips on their Instagram at warmwind underscore OAT. If you're a creator or builder and think this could fit into your workflow, like automating media imports or generating thumbnails in batches, Reach out to Richard's team. They're helping early testers one-on-one -on -one and looking for real use cases to shape the product. And just for transparency, yes, this is a sponsored spotlight, but every clip you saw in the demo section starting around minute four was captured live. No edits, no tricks, just agents doing the work themselves. That's the full breakdown. Links are in the description. Join the waitlist if you're interested and let me know which task you'd hand off first. Catch you in the next one.